content on my YouTube channel is going to consist of, but um, this is something that I, I kind of come to the conclusion that I want to do. I want to do positive talks on here and inspirational talks because at the moment I am in need of them desperately and I appreciate my friends every time they uplift me and I kind of came to a, came, yeah, came to a revelation or had a revelation or whatever. Um, that I want to do something positive on this channel and I didn't really know what I was good at or like what people would want to watch me talking about but I felt like I'm, I'm funny you know what I'm saying people, people would think I'm funny and you know what I'm saying like they, they want to they wanna laugh you know everybody wants to laugh everybody likes to laugh but I feel like something else I'm good at is being a positive light towards people and that people always come to me for advice and I felt like this is something that I should incorporate on my channel. And I'm kind of going through a rough patch right now. I'm not going to lie to you guys. And I don't know. <sighs> this is the second time I'm filming this because I don't know if I want to post this. Because it's kind of personal. And I know I want my YouTube channel to be real. I want it to be real. Um, I just want to have positive talks on here because in the moment like I said at the moment I'm in need of them and I figure that if I speak to myself I'm a firm believer in speaking positive things to yourself so if it takes me getting in front of a camera to speak to myself to help somebody else then I guess I'll do it you know what I'm saying like it kind of makes me uncomfortable because this is public and there's people watching and I only have 13 subscribers but my last video got like a hundred views and there's a hundred people watching me talk about me and it's kind of like you know like it's and that was only my first video and like things get bigger as you go on and I'm kind of like nervous about it and kind of anxious about it but um I'm gonna try so I just came here to say for me personally, I'm not going back to school at the moment, and I just am stuck on what I want to do with my life. I don't know wh where to go or, or what to do or what I love to do or what I'm really good at. Um, so I just came here to say that I appreciate my friends that have been pushing me and that pushed me to do this channel because I wouldn't even be here if it wasn't for them pushing me to do this channel because I don't believe in myself like they believe in me and I appreciate them so much and they support me all the way not going back to school and I love them so much I really do I love them so much it can make me cry um, so I just came in here to say um, don't feel pressured to go to school do what you love and go for it if you love something whether it's sports or whether it's anything whether you like working with your hands, you like being with children, you like working with tech stuff, computers, you like makeup, you like art, whatever it is, go for it. Please go for it. I made the mistake of not pursuing what I love. And I went to school and I'm like, why am I doing this? I didn't hate it, but it, it made me almost go crazy. And I feel like that's not something that you need to endure to be successful you know what I'm saying like put your mental health first and it came to a point where I had to realize that I have to put my mental health first I come first before my degree I am pursuing my degree my degree is not pursuing me and if there's anybody else out there who's feeling the same way that I am this makes me so uncomfortable going out here and talking about this but I, I feel like it's going to help somebody like be real like you know what I'm saying like great for the views but um like being real like for real like because like there's nobody on here on youtube who's talking about how to deal with things like this or how to come up on a youtube channel or how to they're not talking about this stuff in the background where they came from and like 
a lot of these YouTubers didn't go to college, and I can imagine that when they, after they got out of college, how they were feeling, how they were confused, and like me right now, I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I do know that I want to go back to school eventually, but don't feel pressured to go to school because society says that you should. Don't conform to society's standards of of success. You don't need to go to school to be successful, and I will scream that from the top of a building for the rest of my life until I hit the grave because it has been proven to us time and time again. Look at YouTubers making more than six figures a year. I'm just making videos and doing something they love, and that's why I started this because I said, you know what? Maybe I might have a chance to do something. I want to travel when I work. Excuse me. I want to travel when I work, and that's something that I want to go places. You know what I'm saying? I want to experience things. So if there's something that you love, do it. And another thing that I've been struggling with is loving myself. Literally, please, people out there, love yourself. Like, you are everything. You are amazing you are beautiful gorgeous you are that in a bag of doritos like you will make it you will get there eventually everything does not have to fit into right now you have time ahead of you and i know people say you know you never know when life's gonna end but just make the most of it think about you live today like think about that you live Make tomorrow a productive day. Do something that you love. Get on it. If there's something that you're interested in, start it now. Don't wait because, like, you never know. But, like, you are young. So don't pressure yourself to do something that you don't want to do. Is my moment. And don't feel like you have to do everything right now. But if you like something and you know you do, but you're scared to do it because you think everybody else won't accept it, forget everybody else bro i literally felt like i it was cool to be an engineering student and i was thinking about that instead of thinking about my future and i was like oh the money's good and the travel's good but what about my actual job do i actually love it do i want to sit there and do math all day no do i want to work with computers no do i have potential and can i do it absolutely i can because i believe in myself and i know i can do it but do i want to no and it took everything in me to be like it took everything in me to crumble in order for me to be like, I don't want to do this anymore. And it, sh it, shouldn't have gone, it shouldn't have gotten to that point to where I literally felt like I was going insane for me to be like, I can't do this anymore. And so those of you who can do it, all props to you. Everybody who was in my classes, all props to you. I salute you guys a hundred and thousand, over a thousand percent. Will I go back to school? I want to. I do because I feel like I owe it to myself. I was doing something productive. And I didn't hate it. I did like it. And I feel like... I want to complete something that I finish. I started. I, I want to finish something that I started. I don't know why I, I, I came up on here, but I needed to talk to myself, and I kind of helped myself a little bit. I feel a little more comfortable since the first video. But um, guys, you can do it. To my 13 subscribers, you can do it. <laughs> you can do it. Cause I know a lot of my subscribers are probably my friends. Um, from school and I know there's a lot of people who are feeling the same way I am that feel pressured to go to college and who don't know what they want to do and they're in school right now and they're like why the hell am I here I have friends who are interested in dance and singing and acting and in different things and they stop pursuing it because they think that they would never make it but I say bro go for it go for it who cares you can be the one in the million why is that impossible people have made it and been that one in a million so it's not impossible it's not impossible so do it literally do it like i'm not trying to be the next child above just do it but like be you be you like don't conform to, to to society's fashion to society's standards for success for society's standards of love or whatever it is or, or looks or 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 tone or persona or anything like just be you and love you and i and i need to say that to myself more often but love you love you and you form first and foremost love yourself because if you don't love yourself you cannot be successful you can have all the money in the world but i don't care about money money does not equal success and that you can debate me on all day money does not mean success i believe success is when you feel like you've done everything that you want to do completed it the way you want to complete it and you are your uttermost happiest 
you've ever been. You're the uttermost happiest. Okay, I tried to like put that together to be dramatic, but like, not dramatic, but try to emphasize that when you're at your peak happiness, when you feel like you have done it, that is success. When you've done it the way you wanted to do it, and you are the happiest person that you've ever been, you you done it. You did it. You are there. You are successful. And I don't care if you're making six figures. I don't care if you're making like six than six figures. But if you're happy, your hap your happiness at level three thousand is more valuable than any amount of money ever. Because you can have all the money in the world. Money can buy you a lot of things. But if you're not happy, what the hell are you gonna do with all that money? What are you gonna do with all that money? Fill up your house with junk. I I just want to be happy and I'm sure a lot of you all out there want to be happy and if you feel the way I'm feeling you are not alone you are not alone because being at this age it sucks because you don't know what you're gonna do but I encourage you to whatever it is that you're interested in please go for it don't doubt yourself listen to your friends who are your real friends backing you up all the way go for it I'm gonna stop talking now because it's almost at 12 minutes and I don't want to edit this because because I don't like editing but you guys can do it I can do it please love yourself along the way while you are on your road to success because you guys will get there and I will too trust yourself and trust your positive friends who are pushing you there and appreciate them and love them and love yourself and make every day that you have productive because you never know when the next day might come that you may not have a day to be productive the days might end but take every chance that you can get but also don't forget to seize the moment and put your mental health first because there's nothing more important than having your mind straight because if you don't have your head on straight you can't do anything absolutely nothing I'm done talking. I hope that helps somebody. It helped me a little bit. Kind of went on a tangent. I kind of do that a lot when I give advice. And I, I keep saying I don't know if I'm going to post this. But I'm going to post this because I think it's useful for people. And I think it's real. So I want to do a lot more stuff like this. And I don't want to do it when I'm down and sad like this. I kind of want to do it when I've overcome whatever it is that I've gone through so i can be in a happy note um, i think i said a pretty good amount of things so keep your heads up guys to our 13 subscribers and all the other hundreds of views that i've been getting <laughs> thank you guys for watching and supporting me you guys don't even know how much i appreciate it bye guys